What's up, y'all? I'm Anthony. Welcome to the PA News Network right here on Adana, the PA's YouTube channel. Now, this is a brand new segment that Adana's doing right here on her channel where she's going to be bringing you every single week the latest and hottest PA-related news. So if you're excited about that, go ahead and hit that like button right now. Bro! Let her know you want to see this. And this does not in any way take away from the content she's already doing every Sunday. It's in addition to it. So basically, y'all about to get like two videos every single week from her channel instead of just one. So if you like that idea, hit that like button right now. Let's jump right into the news. Here we go. Congratulations to Adana for becoming the number one. Come on, come on. The number one most subscribed YouTuber for PA related content in the world, y'all. So please, right now in the comment section, just tell Adana congratulations, hit that like button, and thank you so much for subscribing and supporting Adana and her channel as she continues to bring you great content for all you PAs and healthcare related people out there. All right, guys, so the PA news of the week, let me throw my glasses on, had to take them off because you know, getting a lot of glare. This says, Rhode Island removes supervision requirements for PAs in favor of expanded collaboration standard for PA practice. This is exciting news. Rhode Island Governor Gina Riamondo. I believe that's how it is. Forgive me, Gene, if I said your name wrong. It says, sign into law an act relating to business professions, physician assistants, which significantly revises the supervision requirements and expands certain aspects of scope of practice for physician assistants in Rhode Island, effective immediately. Among other things, the act removes the current supervision requirements for PAs, changes the nature of the relationship between PAs and physicians to a collaborative arrangement, and removes the requirement that hospitals and other healthcare, excuse me, practices have written PA supervision agreements on files for PAs. Currently, PAs in Rhode Island can only provide medical services under the supervision of a physician in accordance with a written agreement setting forth the level of supervision to be provided, as well as the patient care responsibilities of the PA. The act removes the supervision requirement and PAs will now be allowed to practice in collaboration with physicians and to provide any medical or surgical services that are written, excuse me, that are within the physician assistant skills, education, and training. I'm going to leave a link for this article right in the description box below so you can read the entire article for yourself. Time for our social media shout out of the week. This right here is Miss Maria D. Shout out to you, girl. This is her Instagram right here. She just started, you guys, her PA program at the Duke University School of Medicine. So we want to give her lots of love and just say congratulations for all that you're doing. You keep rocking, girl. And everybody else who just started their PA programs or who will soon be starting their PA programs, shout out to you guys. If you're watching this and you enjoy the idea of having a weekly PA-related news network, right here on Adonis channel, please let us know in the comment section below. Just say, keep it going, keep doing it. It's either going to be myself or Adana or even somebody else may be hosting and uh, just sharing with you guys the news of the week. So if you like this idea, give this video a like. Let us know in the comment section below. And y'all have a fantastic day, man. I'm out. Peace.